This is Trey Ann with the FRVTA, and I am at the Florida State Fairgrounds where the gates have just opened for the 2021 Tampa Bay Summer RV Show. Now we have tons on display here, RVs, vendors, entertainment. So head on down to the Florida State Fairgrounds and get your RV on. As soon as you come through the door, uh, we have a table with some iPads out to register for a door prize. Make sure you stop, fill it out. We're giving away cool gifts every day. So everyone is asking about the mask requirements for the show. Uh, just follow the CDC guidelines. If you've been fully vaccinated, masks are not required. But if you have not been fully vaccinated, we recommend that you do wear a mask. Follow the CDC guidelines and you'll be all good. If you're at the show and you get a little hungry, you don't have to worry about it. There are multiple concession booths here. And the things that are really catching my eye are the dipping Donuts and the savory grapes. One of my favorite things to do at an RV show is to go through all the vendor booths. Uh, we have a wide selection here. Uh, so far, I've seen uh, RV rental companies, electric bikes, there's tools, there's RV accessories, there's insurance companies, there's a little bit of everything. So I'm gonna walk around and see what I can find to buy. There are tons of trailers here from the ultra lights to the ultra bigs. Um, Maya was caught from far away from these LED lights on these Catalinas. i just picturing myself at the campground and I'm the, the party spot. I'm in the Fleetwood Discovery LXC and this is absolutely beautiful. I could definitely full time in this one. So this new camp boondock has so much space inside in like a small teardrop package. You gotta take a look at it. There is literally everything you need in this little package. Uh, you have a kitchenette. There is a wet shower and a king. Looks like this makes into a king size bed. Hey, how are you enjoying the show? It's excellent. Good. Are you buying this? this yes, one? I'm ready to buy this today. <laughs> All right. Thank you. This is the interior of the sport coach and you have to look at the, the tile in the kitchen. It's really unusual and beautiful. If you're shopping for a toy hauler, there are tons of cool options here. Uh, my eye was caught by the Grand Design Momentum G-Class. Let's take a look at it. Okay, tell me this isn't cool. You can have all of your toys sitting out here. And then you have this really nice like outdoor kitchen area. I see a grill and you step right into the coach. Isn't it beautiful? So if you're in the luxury fifth wheel market, uh, this Montana legacy is absolutely gorgeous. Who wouldn't love to camp in this baby? This is the little guy Micron. It's only 345 pounds. That's wonderful. Class B's are so popular right now. There's quite a few at the show, and I've had just a really hard time getting in to see them because there's just a steady stream of people that are looking for the van life. After you go through the entertainment hall and the expo hall, if you come out the back doors, uh, we have a large display out here with pretty much every type of RV imaginable. If you're in the market for a toy hauler, I love this Jayco Seismic. Uh, it's 46 feet and it has the, the normal toy hauler portion in the back that makes into the patio. But I love the side patio option here. It just gives you all that additional outdoor space. Uh, you can sit there, have uh, drinks and eat, or it's a great place for your dogs to run around. It's just, it's really well thought out and the interior is beautiful. This is the kitchen inside the Jayco Seismic. I really love the white cabinetry and looks like the subway tiles back there. It's just really nice. And of course, can't go wrong with a full-size refrigerator. Class C's are always so popular. They're easy to drive. They have everything you need, but this Seneca here is amazing. It's 39 feet and it sleeps eight people with a king size bed. 
I mean, this is like the Mac Daddies of Class C's. And it is beautiful inside. Uh, the colors in here are just gorgeous. If you're shopping for a Class C that's not quite as big as the Seneca, there's tons of other options here as well, both inside and out. I've been having a phenomenal day here at the 2021 Tampa Bay Summer RV Show. There are RVs of all kinds everywhere. There are vendors, anything you could want. Uh, there's food, there's entertainment. It is just a great place to spend the day. Uh, whether you're a full-time RVer, a new RVer, or just dreaming about it, this is the place to be in Tampa this weekend. The gates are open Thursday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. We're at the Florida State Fairgrounds. Make sure you head on down and check out the RVs. Now, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, we will be having more videos on all of our regional shows as well as the big super show next January, as well as videos on uh, local campgrounds. So please make sure you hit subscribe. Thanks again for watching and we will see you at the show.